Here we are again at the Somerset and Dorset Joint Railway for um, brake van update number three. Before I start, uh, I just want to say thank you to Roy Larkham for buying some brushes for our project. So we're just going to have a little wander around and see what's happened since the last time you've seen it. Uh, the decking has been treated uh, with a weather shield, so that's okay. All the fungus and leaves and everything have been cleaned off. The steps are now complete. They're all painted all the way around the vehicle. And these steps here as well, at present they're a bit wet at the moment, so we can't climb the vehicle. This is why we're going to use the ladder in a minute. Uh, we've had a little flood, so I can't take you underneath sadly today. But if we do just have a look in the reflection, you can see the underneath of the vehicle is pretty much ready for being painted. And that should be in the next couple of weeks. All the buffer beams have been painted and treated now. The paint is dry. If we take a wander around this side, through lake, through the lake, careful as we go. These are the steps on the other side, all with new bolts in. And down there as well. The running board has now been filled, treated, all the fungus, the mice and everything have been kicked out. Um, and if we take a little wander down here, and these are the other new steps which are on all fixed and ready to go and if you remember in video one we were going to take a look at this beam um, now this beam is also ready it's complete with his bolts and everything and when we do the, the the column over the other side we can tighten these bolts back up again there is still a little bit of play in there to take up that big gap there but I'm confident we can get rid of that um, now the me next major project on this will be a corner post. So what I'm planning to do here is to remove this post because putting a repair in there isn't satisfactory. I'd say that I say these posts were 40 percent of structural integrity of this vehicle, so it's important that we're going to restore it. It's important to get um, the correct result. Uh, if we just have a look at the top of the post, you can see the fixtures and fittings which have got to be undone in order for the new post to go in. Right, now meanwhile, Bob's been doing a bit of painting again and has kindly cleaned off all this lot. These are all the handrails. We've got various bits of other iron work which sit on the side of the van. These are a couple of rails which he's cleaned off this morning. We stripped the old paint off, we're going to treat those and they're going to get a lovely fresh coat of paint back on them. So if we take over, if we just go over to Bob and we'll see what he's doing. You can see it's important to do a good job. Got to get, get it right back. The old paint. <laughs> yeah. Wonderful job Bob, brilliant. Well done John. It's coming on quite easy actually, isn't it's it? It's not, it's not bad. It's worth it, isn't it really? Yeah. You know, it's just worth the extra effort really. And we can treat that. And then uh, we've got some painting to do. Let's go back over to the van. Now there's been further development since we've cleaned the inside out. So now I can take you into the inside of the van. There's some work to do in here as well. Let's climb up. And here we are, inside an LMS brake van. Now we've got this shroud that goes over here. Um, we're going to get a new one made because the other one's falling to bits. So there's not much we can do about that. It's actually in fairly good condition. There's a floorboard which needs replacing and then of course um, Bob's going to come and clean all this lot off. The, the roof's in excellent condition, all the doors are intact, the windows are intact as well and we've got our wheel. If you have a look closely at the wheel it's had a repair at some point in, it, in time where it's, where it's got broken, probably something dropped on it or I don't know but that works. And let's go and have a look over here. All these windows are intact. And what's good, some of these corner posts here are a bit rotten, but luckily enough, we've got this secondary beam which is screwed to here. So we've got a lot of strength because then that's tenoned down into the floor 
down there. Um, and that's our update for now. I'll bring you some more updates when, when we get some more work done. But thank you very much for watching. Please share it. And if you want to come down to the station, Mondays or Sundays, to come and say hello and to see some of our other projects, you're more than welcome. Hope to see you soon. Thank you and goodbye.